Hi everyone, Matt here with Chelsea Guitar Maintenance and Repair. And to, for today's maintenance tip, I wanted to talk about switches and how you can use them to modify your guitar. I kind of wanted to talk about the common switches and what the names of them mean, uh, how they work, uh, which ones you would want to get for your guitar, and a couple of different ways you can use them. Uh, so this is what we would call a mini toggle switch. They're really popular for modification on guitars. Um, and there are several different types. Uh, you may see some uh, some four-letter uh, descriptions of these, such as uh, SPDT or DPDT. Uh, and what that means, this here is an SPDT switch. And SP stands for single pole, and DT stands for double throw. And what that means, a single pole switch, uh, or, or the number of poles on a switch, means the number of individual circuits you're switching. This is a, a single pole, this is a double pole. You can see that this has three pins, which is one circuit that's being switched. This one has six pins, which the two rows uh, are two different circuits being switched. So that's what the poles mean. Now the throw means how many different connections you are making on each of the poles. So this is a dual th uh, or double throw switch, which means this single pole has two different connections that can be made. This pin is one connection, this pin is another connection. Now why would you use a, uh, a single, uh, single pole or a double pole uh, switch? So a single pole switch is going to switch one uh, circuit. You can use a single pole uh, double throw switch on a guitar for something like as simple as a kill switch. You can connect your output of your guitar to this center pin, which is your common pin. This one's always connected. In this position, this pin connects to this pin. When you flip the switch, this pin now connects to this pin. So you can, for instance, ground your signal uh, here, so when you flip the switch, it dies. So you can have a on-off kill switch. Now moving on to something a little more complicated, the um, double pull, double throw switches can be used the exact same way. You can just hook up one circuit and use it the exact same way as one of these. However, you can switch two things at the same time here, meaning, for instance, if you have a two humbucker guitar, you can split both pickups with one switch because you've got two independent circuits. Another thing you can do with a, uh, a double pull, double throw switch is you can do phase inversion, meaning that you can reverse the polarity of your pickup with a flick of the switch because you actually need a positive and a negative on your independent circuits, and then you flip them as you flip the switch, it reverses the positive and negative. Um, most of your push-pull potentiometers, which you may see um, on a lot of guitars, are going to have a double-pull, double-throw switch attached to them. That is the switching mechanism generally on a push-pull pot. So you can use it the exact same way as one of these switches. Um, now there are also multiple ways that these switches come. So this switch is a single pole double throw again but it's an on on switch meaning that there are only two positions on the switch these two pins connected or these two pins connected you can also get these switches in an on off on configuration meaning that you have one position with these two a center position i can't do it on this one but a center position with neither connected only the center it's sort of floating it's not connected to anything and then a third position with the other two with the other um the other pole connected. So I'm going to do a couple more videos in the future showing ways to actually connect these switches and, and modify your guitar. Uh, so look for those in the coming weeks and we will uh, talk to you guys then. Bye.